Hey, what's up, fellas? Koi Myru here, and welcome back to World of Horror. But not just normal World of Horror. You know, I beat that. I conquered that. I'm, I'm the World of Horror king. I'm the horror king. Okay? Everyone knows me at this point. But, a heavily modded World of Horror, essentially. I just went to the Steam Workshop and just like, oh, I'll just get some random mods in here for fun. And I, I don't know what's going to happen for the most part. It's a lot of, it was a lot of event stuff, a lot of characters, a lot of different random stuff. I was like, that sounds fun. So I think I just have to go here. I press random on backstory and character. And this is the old god thing. I believe you have to select as well. Ooh. Oh, endless mode, classic mode, scenario mode. Oh, we'll, we'll go classic, normal. And it's like old god. I don't think this matters. I already beat the spider. Oh, no, I never beat the spider. Okay, we'll fight the spider. How did I still go random and get a normal? Okay, as you can see, we're ready now. <laughs> oh, I have to choose. We'll go this one. Let's grab our items. Look at our boy. Oh, frick, we can't change clothes. We'll keep this one on, though, because it's nicer. Got money. You know I remember this game. You know me. Take a take an XP bath. We're starting mystery. Look at our boy, ready for anything. Do Moonlight Sailor. I hardly remember that one. Let's hop over your investigation. Discard two item cards to complete this quest. That is very specific. Uh, I have nothing I want to discard right now, so we'll just continue. I'm going to go shopping. Buy funds. So if I, is it, if I discard this... Alright, let's go, let's go again. It's just to get the best ending. There you go. Find a huge pile of nets and hooks prepare for the big hunt. You quickly throw them to the ocean. Maybe that'll stop them from sailing out. There you go. Look at the hunter! Then a little hungry, you approach the nearby food stall. You shut it when the cook's creepy stare and grin. Well, welcome to the little shop. I have the freshest cuts, the best seasonings, my family's recipe. My family's recipe to make it even better. How can I help you today? I shouldn't eat anything from this guy. I'm walking away. Well, don't worry. You'll be back soon. I I have a DIY flamethrower. I burn his little stall down. Trust me. Anyway. We have the stench for hours. You glean nothing besides the fact that fishman and white. I just pay her a visit. That's our wife now. Okay, this is, as you can see, this is some random. Uh, you were walking around downtown when you saw Veronica secretly following someone. Veronica knows you and asks for your opinion. Wish that handcuffs. I'll observe. All success. You discreet observed the suspicious person and got the crucial information. Turns out he has connections to a secret organization. Sweet. Plus some I gained reason and experience. Frick yeah. Uh, when you arrive at the house, stands long vacated. And peering into the dusty window, you recoil in shock. I don't think you can hear my mouse anymore. If not, not as nearly as loud. I have a completely new mic setup. I probably forgot to mention. This is a completely new mic setup thing that I got for my mic. And it's freaking beautiful. I love it. <laughs> it's so much better. Anyway, you find a tree that has a big white lump attached to its trunk. As you move closer, you realize what it is. A huge egg sack. Tiny spiders crawl over from the hole to hole, and you think that uh, you can see the whole thing throb gently. Something stuck between out of the layers of the web. I have a freaking DIY flamethrower. I need a torch. Climb the tree. Got the dexterity. What's my highest thing? Oh my god, Hunter is broken. I was not looking at the Hunter stats at all. He has 10 strength and 10 dex. That's canon, but Jesus. Uh, do, do, do. You climb down and examine your pride. It seems to be a statuette of something. Yeah. Yeah, hold it. I'm smarter now. 
Hunter is broken. Go through all the mysteries. Oh, it's nothing. You notice that a lot of strange events such as eerie noise unexplained disappearance happening lately might be related to the spooky mud Madaraka Madaraki uh, state. You are sneaking through the mansion shadow corridors when I know where Veronica dashes towards you. Frick. She threatened you to leave. She threatened me to leave. She took too well. Yeah, she stabbed me in the uh, chest and told me, all right, limp out of here. It's not threatening me to leave. I, it kind of is threatening. More assault. What the? Do you see? Yeah. I'm sure it's fine. It's absolutely nothing strange happening at all. Continue. You didn't see anything. I I don't mess with that. <laughs> I, that's what I would do in real life. Young man, that's, that's the eyes of mumbles. As replies, he caresses his catch. I feel like I'm always screaming at World of Horror videos because the music is a lot louder than it is for you than it for me than it is for you. So I'm speaking in a lot louder tone. <laughs> that's just like natural though, I suppose. Beating movements. Let's say mumbles replies. Of course, catch the beating movements of his arms disturb you. I'm walking away. Wandering around the seaside, you climb a large rock formation. Turning around, you notice that you have a splendid view of Shiokawa from here. It's far away, it looks peaceful. Consider the future. Oh, God. Okay. Our reasons should not be this low so soon. We got to do our old strategy. You go home and you rest for a little. Just get back up and you go back out. That's all it is. You just got to. I was the biggest thing. Like remembering when to rest was really important in world of horror because if your reason got too low and you got into a fight like my reason was fine there like if i got into a fight at 13 i wouldn't have lost reason and died or anything it's just better to, to keep an eye on it you spot at night and race towards be terrified of what comes next and we know this you arrive at the water's edge breathless the possessed fishermen both fields are rising with their life tiny yellow spots navigating across the dark ocean under a dark sky you cannot make out the figures on board it's not the sailors the black beings must have left their bodies. Shocked, you watched them sail their way out, oh, out of the harbor. They're terrified at their power, but were relieved that they did not drag their meat puppets with them. Frick yeah, easy. I said it's easy um, to do stuff once you get like the true ending for the quest. But more and more, the police have restricted access to the school's building. I don't care. I don't need to go to the school. I am the school. <laughs> Hunter looks so funny just walking around like that. Oh, God. Boop, 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 boop. You're in the hospital coming for treatment when you meet the famous doctor, Fran, and her uh, entourage of newly graduated doctors. And she with free treatments. I'm... I'm okay. Try to observe the category of the you. You have more feeling... Be more, more confused than before. That took away my experience. Jesus. Are you still in the hospital? Let's just keep going. Being that your sickly neighbor, Yeko chan has been admit again admitted to the local hospital for a life-saving surgery, you decide to visit her to brighten her mood. Asking her about her last at the time at the hospital, however, only gives you funny stares from the receptionist. You enter the room where personal surgery patients are kept at, and you enter with rising horror, you realize that Yiko chan is no longer herself. Oh, surgery gone wrong? Aspen. That is not... Oof. Don't worry, Diego. I'll make it quick. Burn! I'm a good friend. I'm a really good friend. Some elongated arms, jelly fried bones. Well, we got that. Door her apartment was close. She lived alone. Other ways, other in. And now we can go investigate her place. Uh, amidst your investigation, you are irresistibly drawn to a cursed site, a seemingly expanding domain that drains the very essence of yours. Am I trapped in Gojo's domain? What, what's going on? There you go. You visit the absolute domain, your mind strong and unyielding with unwavering resolve, you pass through the domain with poise, emerging victorious against this ominous bowl. Hey, nice. Hey, neighbor. Oh, another time? Got you. Because apparently, I, I just look really normal. <laughs> I love because the hunter looks like he looks in place with the things you see in the game, but he looks out of place when talking to a normal human being. Too small for anyone. You burn, Yako Chan. Oh, what's going on? Hell? Turn around and see the source of the sword screaming. With horror, you look on as your elderly neighbor, Miss Ooh, slowly assumes a bizarre abstract shape with curves and lines that should not be possible. 
I, I got you, Misu. You grab her misshapen hand and returns to its former shape. Taking a risk, you pull your neighbor into a hug, breaking Eldritch's spell. If you have any idea what would have happened, you look at I'm like the strongest man alive. Jesus. I, I helped her. I don't know. She was going to turn to the internet. Some horrifying man. She's going to be the neighbors. Maybe discover something the police miss. I'm doing my own personal investigation, citizen investigation. This past. Could you imagine this guy knocking on your door and asking you questions? You ain't tell him anything. It's past midnight when your phone rings. Who could it be? Pains and rise, it is awake. The flesh of fallen angels, the hole that is gone. Leave now. Now, 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 now. Slam down your phone, your heart pounding, your legs feeling weak. Freaking knew it was gonna mess up my reason. I knew it. One neighbor. One neighbor's playing by her missing underwear. I remember this one now. I, I was like, I was thinking it was that one. Yeah, we remember this one. Looking horror as you heard two ghastly friend in front of you squabbling who gets to operate your body. Can it be both of them? Okay, no, no, right. Let's focus up. It's a ghost. Frick, it's a ghost. How do I handle ghosts again? I don't have enough money. No, yeah, just do an offering with some money. We're not running. Let's just do that and dodge. Where's that thing? As long as we keep dodging, we're good. I'm just going to keep severing and dodging. Hey, yeah, you dodge the attack. Yeah. You hit him with the dodge. You hit him with the sever the connection. And that's it. I got a new item. I got a new level up again? Jesus. Mysterious meat for completing a mystery? Hmm. That's something new, so we'll go for it. Let's get some reason back. Cool. Awesome, yeah. The neighbors complain about weird noise coming from the vintage at home. Oh, wow. You recently noticed a door yeah? shadowing your every move. Although you tried to overlook her presence, today she extended both her arms towards you. Look at her son just to wondering how to respond. Your relentless just give her the hug she obviously wanted. It turns out she was trying to help by replacing your damaged organs, but your strength prevents you from fully blacking out. You listen to her as she begins operating you, opening you up, feeling everything while she switches your organs with hers. Should not have hugged this woman. She has made me traumatized. What series or franchise are these characters even from? I told you, I just went to the workshop and installed stuff. I didn't even know what I was doing. Well, I'm traumatized now. Let's keep going. My Vince. Yep. Oof. You almost fall to the ground when you see a wide open stair of a dead pervert. It's a long eight arm stretching disappearing to the visible darkness. Inside his mouth, you find a tiny key. And also, centipedes. Let's the whole building gets searched, following the arms, detected find the body of a man stuck in a ventilation shop. Later, he has identified the building caretaker. In his closet, police find pieces of underwear. And vulgaristic photos of the tenants. All in a day's work. I'm leveling up again. My God. Forgot to go perception. But one's express perception, one's a charisma. I feel like we're too powerful. <laughs> I did not expect Hunter to be this powerful. I just, you know, I love Bloodborne. It's like my top three favorite game. And I was not expecting Hunter to just have the most powerful stats. It's canon. It makes sense. But Jesus. Dangerous bands. Yeah. Okay. The Riders or whatever. I got a tiny key, right? Nope, let's put that right back in there. I think the tiny key that's probably used to 
open that one lock in the school thing, right? It's like the, the slip mouth woman or whatever. I don't think we have that mystery, so the time key's kind of worthless. We can do this one with five different endings. Oh, it's, just the, it's just the janitor one. How is there five endings for this one? I've never got any of them. The push that you fall into. Thanks for that game. You're going crazy, but you swear someone is watching from the sea. And then we can go to the usual. And the girl has gone missing, and we gotta go investigate. Back way as Gavra walks slowly with her paw like hand that switch open toward me. Why? What is it? Why does everyone want to kill me? I, I know these people. I just want to. I'm burning you alive, Gavril. Oh my god, I missed? Oh, she she might be a. Hold on. She's got like a lot of health. Hold on. Give me a uh, dodge here. I'm literally missing. I'm, I'm pressing a dodge action every time. I missed all of them. Okay, well, look, well, come on, we're just gonna we're just gonna keep. Oh crap! I just dodged. Gabriel grabs your head and throws you. She grabbed me by the head and threw me. Okay, hold on. Oh my gosh, she's gonna kill me. She's actually gonna kill me. This woman's gonna kill me. Strong attack, strong attack. Yo, I missed. Oh my god, no way. There's no way I die like this. I miss every... Okay, okay, we're screwed. We are absolutely screwed. Why is she so freaking strong? I'm dead. I just got so unlucky and just fought an actual demon. We're dead no matter what here. Like we can we can kill her, but like oh, we can't even kill her. Why did I what did I do? What did I even do? Oh, she's got a gun? Okay. And handcuffs. It's a little cop that we got. And she's actually more balanced. I decided to go for something that was a little bit more balanced because Hunter was like really strong, pretty much. I'm amazed that that character killed him. Like, Jesus, that, that think how strong she was. You can play her too, the lady that killed him. Gavril? Gun! Shoot. Gun! You know, it is just freaking gun keeps jamming. Come on. She's going to kill me. You know, <clears throat> it, technically it wasn't her that killed me. So I, I'm still really freaking good at the game. Oh wait, never mind. That was not the hardest difficulty. I, now it's the hardest difficulty. Playing as this little little person, lady, coma person. Yeah. They're also fearful because they woke up from a coma and tried to find a sister. It's some interesting lore. I just read it. Uh, let's do our usual. This is like the hardest difficulty, so I don't really know how this is going to go. That's drippy as frick. It's like Koichi outfit. Maybe it is like that. Let's go. What do you do? Oh, reason is stamina. That's cool. Hey, let's wait a little bit. Let's get it. Let's see if we can get another. Let's go. Minus one strength. Get up out of here, bro. Get up out of here. Anyway. Oh, dang well, you should not be on my team with that. And let's go to library and see if we can get some spell. Until the end of calm, until the end of the current mystery, there's no doom penalty for escape of combat. It costs four region. So let's go investigate the school, though. 
you know, the bloodthirsty botanist or whatever. Run, run, Gravel the wolf in the downtown. Run, run. Managed to flee before she even sits your presence. Thank God. She would have ripped my freaking head off. Oh, thank God. I had to wait to visit the time. Library, library has several sections, each containing books that might be useful to you. Manga! Decided to read some shonen manga. Obviously, you don't learn anything useful, but the combo action packs superhero stories you take your mind off the horrible events happening around you. I mean, that was worthless, but I mean, that's, come on, that's what we all wanted. No man stops you and invites you into his house. You follow reluctantly and be amazed by a number of dusty old sorcery books. I think you're thinking too about magic, he says. Don't worry about the payment. I'm sure we'll work it out in the future. Hey, yeah. Defeat target human. Oh, wow. It just straight up just straight up kills a human immediately. And we're in the forest section now. We're checking through the forest. We're suddenly Veronica emerged from a circle of darkness. That man's in front of you. Whew, finally out. You carefully question Veronica about the portal and learn that it's a gateway to another realm. Share some insights with you as you're... Oh, I got another spell. I don't mind losing that. I got third eye. One plus launch perception to the end of the mystery. Maybe. Something feels off. Isn't too early for the leaves to change the color for you to risk some grab your light. Bark woman. Oh, frick. I don't have a weapon. Okay. Give me a moment. Uh, let me look for an improvised weapon on the ground. And just like punt kicker. Got that freaking broken bottle. So are how broke you are. Okay, she she might actually kill me. She's going to kill this. This character's not super strong. We just won. Oh wait, actually, you know, I'm gonna do that to guarantee the attack. Okay, that rose on ends. You have to go back. I think we're dead. <laughs> we have one health. Uh, you were losing your way in the forest. Me something? Are you lost? Random star guilty to your face as she finds your face suspicious. Suspicious. I'm freaking dead. And she wants to fight me. I got away. I got away. We got away. We good. We good. We good. We good. We, we're going to make moves. Trust. 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 You're losing your wind foils when you met a little girl wearing a bunny coat. At least someone could be so cool as to leave the kid in the forest. Can you give me directions? I'm scared out here myself. <laughs> a map. Oh, thank you. Thanks. With a hint of annoyance on her face. She, you know, but she gave it to me. Finally, after what feels like, I think I'm dead here. Like, cause I just, <laughs> oh, right. Oh, oh, my bad. Yeah, it wasn't the doom doing that. It was the freaking reason. So I, that, that sister lady did kill me. It was my reason. That's, that's it for me. <laughs> I've, no, hold on. I am still the king of this game. I am still the king of War of War. It does not change anything. I, uh. A new thing is going on the channel. I was just going to do like a silly little modded playthrough um, just to test my new microphone stuff out. And just because I was like, you know what? I thought about this when I beat the game. I never got to it. So let's just try it. And I got destroyed by quite literally everything. These NPCs with the most health I've ever seen in the game. And it's just it's it's horrifying, really. It, it's it's world of horror. <laughs> But now the, the freaking new thing we're doing on the game is now I'm going to beat this game on the hardest difficulty. I feel like I literally have to now. Like it, like the game's challenged me to beat this on the hardest difficulty now. That might be based. That might be modded. We'll see. I want to beat modded run first. After we beat modded run, then we might just go like full difficulty. Because I don't want to do like a modded uh, max difficulty. People are like, well, that's not that's not the same. You got modded stuff. It's not as it's not as respectful. But actually, no one no one's thinking that. I'm the king of World of War. No one's respecting me. So we're gonna do that though. Uh, just for funsies, because I I love this game, and there hasn't been the update yet. It's coming soon, but it's not been yet. 
So I've just been craving to play it more. <laughs> but I do hope you still enjoy me getting quite literally destroyed by every single thing. You know, the king, my, my crown fell. I'm picking it back up. It's going to come back next time. And we're going to go through it again. <laughs> I do sincerely hope you guys enjoyed the video. Thank you so much for watching. And I'll see you guys on the next one. Peace out.